Thanks to the next generation of video game systems, gamers throughout the world can battle each other by linking up in virtual worlds. Players can communicate and experience their surroundings in high definition. The Air Force is doing the same thing to accomplish joint training missions in virtual space. It's the best video game in the world. It's Xbox Live taken to the nth degree. The simulators have 360 degree screens, so pilots can see everything they would be able to see from an actual cockpit. It's called Distributed Mission Operations, or DMO, and it allows pilots to train on things they normally couldn't. The simulator does a lot of things that the aircraft is not able to do simply because we can't go out and practice getting shot at for real. In addition to combat training, the sims get pilots familiar with airspace before flights, putting flight hours to better use. We can now fly them in the, in the simulator and get a local area orientation. So now they can take the sortie that they saved and they can go out and practice their combat skills a lot better. The simulators create the possibility for virtual missions involving pilots that wouldn't normally get to train together. Uh, we can link four F-15 simulators that are here at Langley with four F-15 simulators at Eglin Air Force Base and practice a ship ops at a fraction of the cost of what we can actually do if we were to actually get eight aircraft up to airborne. Program managers say simulator training will never take the place of in-flight training, but in the end should yield a better trained pilot. Staff Sergeant Mike Slater, Langley Air Force Base, Virginia.